in this land of crumbling temples where farmers and fishermen worked dawn to dusk while kings were seen as divine gods on earth Sokka was born in this land of two seasons the dry sunny season and the wet monsoon season a patchwork of green rice fields flourished as Sokka grew in this land imbued with animism where rocks and trees vibrate with helpful or vengeful spirits called the nectar who must be appeased Sokka prayed in Cambodia Kampuchea the land of the Khmer people history is long and memories are steeped in the anger and violence of warlords and kings in the northwestern province of Battambang, amid beauty and strife, Sakha's story begins.